I'm excited to do this. Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video on my channel. If you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that big red subscribe button and the post notification bell. That way you get notified every time I upload a brand new video. Um, and yeah, that'd be very well appreciated. And it would also be very well appreciated if you smash that like button. And yeah guys, so let's get in with today's video. Hello guys, welcome back to today's video. And in today's video, as you can tell by the very beginning, what I did, well, you probably, you probably didn't know what in the heck it was, but... As you know, we're probably going to be doing something related to toys. But yeah, guys, so in today's video, or so, not today's video, I already said that. Um, So whenever, we just went out to the store not that long ago. It's only 1 o'clock, um, and we went to the store. Uh, well, it doesn't matter the time, but basically at the store, we went over to, oh my god, where did we go? Oh, Target, yes, we went over to Target. And don't judge me, don't call me girly or anything, but I got these Hatchimals. Yes, it, it just looks girly just because the purple is, the purple stuff. But basically, if you guys don't know what Hatchimals are, and oh yeah, they're, they're, it's rated everyone. Um, and I, I see a lot of boys in Hatchimals. It's, it's nothing to really say, it's girly. Um, but yeah, so basically, they're actually really cool. Um, basically, you have these, um, it's like a little egg. It's almost like it hatches, it's like you have the egg. And it's saying that you hold it and stuff, and eventually, at some point, it hatches. It's just a random point. It just hatches open, and a little stuffed animal type thing comes out. They sort of look like this a little bit. Um, but basically, it comes out um, of the egg. And, yeah, it's it's really cool. But they're really expensive. The big one costs, like, $80. It's really expensive. That's the max. It could be, like, $100. It's so expensive. But, guys, once we hit, like... Maybe in the millions of subscribers, I will do a, a big Hatchimal video. Um, but yeah, so I got the mini ones, um, just because it was cheaper. And yeah, so th this this was eight dollars, and these are like the mini. They call them collectibles. Get it? Cause egg collectibles, but they're actually just collectibles. Um, and yeah, so it's that's that's pretty much what it is. It's really cool. Um, I'll read you the details on that later. But on to the other thing, guys. I'm so sorry, guys. I got another fidget spinner. Yeah, so after we finished going over to Target, we head over we headed over to Michael's, which was around that area, and we were just shopping. Um actually actually guys, I totally messed up. What I told you about the Hatchimals was right, but actually I got the fidget spinner at Target and the Hatchimals at Michael's. Sorry, I got I got confused there. Um but yeah, so basically um, I got this whenever we were at uh, Target, and they had, like, these different ones. Um, they, they had them all different colors, but th I think this is, like, a rubber type thing. It's, like, almost like a silicone, but give me one moment. Um, I think it's somewhat related to this one, but I'm not quite sure. Yeah, but, yeah, so it's sort of, like, rubber-like, I think. I'm not quite sure, but the bearings look a lot nicer. I've seen them like this. They sort of look, like, circly. They're not, like... I'm not going to get up again, but um, it's not like the metal bearings you see in the center. It's sort of different. Um, so, yeah, and so today's video, I'm just going to unbox these and sort of see how it works. Um, I'm only going to use one here because I want to hatch one outside of the video. Um, I'm going to hatch one during the video, and if I just been around box. And, guys, whenever we hit, remember the giveaway, I'm not going to tell you about it. You can look up my older videos for that. Um, but in the giveaway, the fidget spinner, um, I don't know if you guys want, like, one of these or something like that. I was thinking about maybe getting this and saving it for you guys to give away, but I'm not, I, I remember, I was like, wait. I told them that they can pick the color fidget spinner that, that they wanted, so you guys pick the color and I'll get it. Just, like I said, try to keep it a simple color, and tell me if you want, like, a regular one or, like, one of these, because we can, I don't know if they may still sell these, so just think of a backup plan, a backup color, and a backup fidget spinner. Um, but, yeah, so what should we do first? Um, I think we should do a fidget spinner first. Actually, let's do any mini mini mo. Actually, no, let's not. I'm gonna do fidget spinner first because it's so simple. Okay, so it's in the plastic. We gotta open this. Oh my god. Oh, there we go. Yeah, good cardboard. Um, so now we gotta. Oh, there we go. There we go. You see, now you just gotta get it from there. Oh my gosh. That's not rubber like. Oh my gosh, that feels so satisfying. Sort of. So let's take the plastic, not the plastic, the stuff off. And there we go, there it is. Now we just gotta pop it out. Oh my gosh. Just gonna do that. Ready? Boom. There we go. And this is the plastic stuff. I like to keep those I don't, sometimes. I, I, I'm not quite sure why. I just like to keep them maybe just like 
with some of that was a fail. Oh my gosh, so much trash. Um, but I usually like, just like to keep it in like the package. I don't know why. Don't don't judge me. <laughs> um, but yeah. So here's the fidget spinner. Let's see how long it spins. No, I'm actually kidding, guys. We're not gonna wait that long. But man, this thing actually looks really nice. It's not rubber coat. It's not rubber or anything. You just see that? It looks a lot more smoother. Dang, that actually is really nice. I, I didn't even lube it or anything. I literally just took it out of the package, and it's, it's like, perfect. Dang. I actually like the bearings of the ones with the little, uh, you know, they're just, the ones like this. I don't know why, I just do. Let's see if we can get the illusion to happen. Like I said a few videos ago, I actually, um, I was saying that the illusion only happens in the camera with most of my fidget spinners. If you're in the dark, it actually would work. Um, let's see if it works. I'm not going to show you because... Actually, I'm, I'm not. I, I don't know why. I, I just open my desk drawer to see if there's darkness in there, but it's not much darkness. Um, but yes, this is the fidget spinner. It actually is really nice. I would suggest maybe putting this on your, if you guys win the giveaway, putting this on, like, getting one of these fidget spinners. And, yeah, if, and the backup would just be the other fidget spinners. Um, but yeah, it's up to you guys, though. Um, but man... I feel like I'm just missing something. I don't. I don't know why. I just opened the fidget spinner. I feel like I'm missing something. I. Don't, I don't know why, but it's. It's really nice. So, yeah. Man, I, I can't stop spinning this. Um. But yeah. So let me go add this over to my collection. <sighs> oh my gosh, guys. I just noticed that these two look like the exact same color, except this one looks a little more warmer. Let's see which one, and we're not going to see which one spins faster. Actually, I'm going to see if this one spins on the, yeah, it spins on the table. Um, but yeah, so don't fit this in. I'm going to put it back over here. Ugh. I officially now have seven fidget spinners. Oh, actually eight, because my 3D fidget spinner, I didn't include that. Okay, so now onto the Hatchimals, guys. Um, yes, um, I'll actually look at this before I open it. Um... Is there, like, a certain way to, like... Because it says what you're supposed to do is if you actually, like, rub that heart part, it's supposed to, like, turn a different color. Um, but if you hold it like this, it actually... Um... Um, oh my gosh. What was I going to say? Oh, yeah. Once you hold it, I think the heat, like, eventually hatches it. So, yes, yeah, so let's, let's just open this. I'm actually really afraid I'm going to, like, drop drop it and then it's going to crack. This is actually really cool, guys. It's like it just... It's got a little... Is that maybe, like, a key to open it? Oh, gosh. No, I, I guess it's not. Um, oh, guys, also, um, this has nothing to do with this topic, but, uh, before I open this, this is, ha like I said, this has nothing to do with any of this, but this is just something I could tell you probably in a vlog video, but I have to say that I thought this was really crazy. Actually, I'm over-exaggerating. It wasn't crazy. It was just something funny. Um, so, my neighbor way down there, like, like, that, that's outside my window, um, like, you guys can't, well, I guess you can sort of see out there, but way down there, like, way down there is our neighbor that my mom knows, and I, every day, because she's gone, so every day I, I run over there just by myself, just run down the street and get her mail for her, and I'm, like, so afraid the neighbors are gonna, like, like, say, wait, what are you doing with her mail, like, like, I'm a robber, I'm, like, robbing her mail and that stuff, but I'm actually just keeping it for her. Um, and yeah, I'm just doing something nice. And when I was walking on the street, I didn't get caught. I actually already done it twice. I still have to do it. I haven't done it yet, but this will be my third time. But I was walking on the street, and I haven't, like I said, I haven't got caught yet. But I'm still, I'm just marching on the street. I'm like, I'm like singing the song, like I will not get caught because I'm awesome, and no one will notice that I am getting her mail. And yeah, yeah, you get the point. Um, but yeah, so it's basically, I was just, like, marching down, like, bump, 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 li like, literally, I was just, like, singing that, and I didn't get caught, so who knows, maybe it worked, um, but yeah, so I was just gonna share that with you, I thought that was pretty funny, um, but yeah, so back then with the hatch mole, let's open this bad boy, oh my gosh, how does this, oh, oh, I figured it out, I'm trying not to rip it or anything, I actually opened it this way, oh my god, I just thought that was really funny, oh my gosh, what, what the, Wait, why is one in plastic and one is like rest? Oh, maybe because it has a. Oh gosh. Oh, I was afraid the egg cracked. Oh my gosh. Um. Oh, this this just came with it. It's a little nest. Okay, how do I open this? Literally, how do I open this? How? I'm afraid I'm gonna like hatch it inside the plastic. I'm gonna see how this works actually. Okay. Oh, it actually doesn't fall out. Okay, I wish there was, like, instructions to tell you what in the world to do. 
What in the world? There's like no instructions. Oh wait, yes there is. Well, they take it out. So you hold it, and hatches, and you play with it. That's what it says. It says, hold hatch play, like right there. Hold hatch play. Okay, I really don't know. Oh, oh, it comes with instructions. How nice. Look at these awesome instructions. Look at this stuff, y'all. But yeah. So yeah, so let's read this stuff. Okay. Uh, I'm so glad it came with instructions. What is this? I, I don't know. There's like another set of instructions or something. Okay. Oh, this is one in Spanish, one not. Okay, number one, hold. Hold the egg in your hands. Rub the heart. When it changes from purple to pink, it's ready to hatch. Hmm. Maybe it hatches quickly. Um, tip. The speckles on the egg tell you which family it's from. How oh, cool. Number two, hatch. Gently press right above the the heart with your thumb to crack. Continue pushing the egg until the top can be removed. Oh, guys, these are hatchimals, but I thought, oh, wait. I thought it just hatched on its own, but maybe since it's the mid. Did you guys see that? That thing just moved by itself. No, I'm just kidding. There, there ain't no ghost. It's the airman up there. It's moving it. Let me just start on it. Stay still, boy. You know what? Throw, it, throw that over there. Um, but back to what I was saying. Where did I just hit the instruction? So, uh, assumingly on the egg, you're supposed to, like, rub your finger on the heart, and it tells you when it's ready to hatch. If it turns pink, it's ready to hatch. And then you just, you're just you supposed to crack it open. I thought it cracked open itself. I, I did not know that. Okay, play. Take your hatchimal collectible out of the egg. Remove the remaining eggshell pieces above the perf forwarded line. I'm sorry, I, I cannot read. <laughs> I'm just kidding, I can't. Dispose of them in the clear plastic inside. Tip. The bottom of the egg can be used as a nest. The bottom of the I thought this was used as the nest. Maybe the egg goes in there. Oh, that's what it was. Okay. So we're only gonna hatch one, like I said, but oh, excuse me. The question is, how do you actually get this out of the egg thing? Oh, wait. Wait a second. Wait, this part actually comes off, like the tab thing. And then this part comes out. Oh, I see. I see. I see. I see. Oh my gosh, this tip is. Mm, there we go. There we go. Yeah, there. There we go. That's much better. That's the treasure. Okay, now we got it. Oh, oh, I forgot to read this book. Maybe this is like the, because you got the collectibles and, you know, it's got the families and that stuff. It's actually pretty cool. Um. Tells you what, what it is. Um, so there's five different one, not five. There's actually more than five, but there's so there's different. Ones. Okay, I got the ones from the jungle. Okay, because if you sort of see, it tells you what color code it means, and I have the purple. So purple. Oh my gosh, it's jungle. So apparently, I'm either gonna get one of those or one of these. Yes, right there, one of those. I'm not going to predict. I'm just going to open it. Um, it's going to be two two of those, actually, but one for this video. Um, but how in the world? Literally, I'm actually very confused right now. I really don't know how this... Oh, it comes out the front! I'm so dumb. Actually, I'm not dumb. I just made a mistake. <laughs> um, oh, my gosh. So it just comes right out of this area. You see? We're going to hatch this one. Okay. Gosh, how does this open? Oh, my God. How does this open? Is it like secured in there or something? I don't want to like hatch it inside. Oh, there we go. I think I think I got it. I think I got it. Yeah, it's squeezing a small space. What? Oh, there we go. There we go. That's the sugar. It's actually good that it's secured in there. That means the other one won't hatch. Okay. Okay, so we got the egg. It actually feels. It actually looks really cool. You can actually listen to that. I don't know if you hear that. Um, the bigger ones they actually like make noise. I think. So. Yeah. So. You know when it's ready to hatch whenever you rub your finger on it and that turns pink. Has it turned pink yet? Nope, it hasn't. I think you have to, like, wait. I'm not quite sure. I did just read the instructions, but I'm not quite sure if you're supposed to wait or what you're supposed to do. So, hold the egg in your hands. Rub the oh, you're supposed to hold it in your hands. Okay? Hold it in your hands. Rub the heart. When it changes from purple to pink, it's ready to hatch. So that must be your body heat. It maybe changes the color. My my actually, my hands are actually cold right now because of the air vents freezing me. Okay. 
sort of looks a little pink. I'm not, I'm not quite sure, but I think it's going to take forever. Let's do some time lapse right now. Okay, guys, so I have, I've pulled it, I've pulled it for probably like a minute now. Um, it was a little warm. Um, yeah, my hands are really cold, like I said. Um, let's, let's rub it and see if it, no, it doesn't. Um, it's gonna take a while. Okay, it hasn't been that long. I was just gonna tell you guys, I thought the Hatchimals always made noise. I don't know if maybe it made, makes noise out of those holes. I'm not quite sure, but I'm just saying, I mean, I'm just, I'm just not quite sure. <laughs> Um, I don't know if I'm going to be able to hatch this in today's video, guys, honestly. Hold it in your hands, it says. Okay, I'm holding it. Hold the egg in your hands. Rub the heart. When it changes from purple to pink, it's ready to hatch. <sighs> I, I, need, I need to make my hands warm. Do this. I'm actually going to heat the egg up. I wonder if it's actually maybe cold. I'm not quite sure because I just... Oh, it's turning... I thought it just turned pink. What in the world? I could see like little specks of pink on the outside, literally. Now let's rub it. It's turning, it's a little pink, sort of. It's, it's getting a little lighter. I don't know if you guys can see that. Maybe I have to hold it a little longer. <sighs> this is gonna take forever, for real. Okay, let's try it now. Uh, my gosh, this is taking forever. What in the world? Seriously. This is actually taking forever. Um, but, yeah, guys. Um, I think I'm gonna have to end the video there, because I don't want to have this video take forever. Um, yeah, this is probably gonna take a really long time, and like I've been saying, I can only record a certain amount of minutes on my iPad. Um, but yeah. It, it's taking forever. Um, but guys... I'm probably not going to be able to record it. Maybe I'll, I'll have luck and maybe I'll be able to record it. Like, record the egg hatching. Just, just, wherever I'm at. Um, but if not, I'll tell you guys what happens. Um, actually, you know, I'm going to try something. I'm, gonna, I'm rubbing my hands on my jeans, so it's making a lot of friction. Let's see if it works now. This is the last chance, and then I'm just going to end this video. And next video, or whenever, I'll probably next video, I'll tell you what happens. And I'll just sort of tell you that way you guys know. Um... I'm gonna, I'm gonna laugh if it actually works. Oh, oh my gosh. It's actually turning pink a little bit. Maybe the heat is what makes it change. Let's see here. Yeah, it's pinker than the other one. You know, I'm gonna actually put some heat on my thumb and rub it. Let's see if that actually works. Yeah, guys, it's not working. It's still purple ish. I wonder what happens if you just drop it a little bit. Oh, it doesn't crack. Okay. But yeah, guys, hope you like today's video. Again, next video, probably, I'll tell you what happens to the egg. Um, but yeah, guys, hope you like today's video. Make sure if you like the video, hit that like button. And yeah, guys, hope I'll see you in the next video. This is DBM signing off. Or DBM. DBM 8.0 signing off. See ya.